after bool c um, i'd like to show you the alpha function so alpha function earlier we had conversion exit underscore internal or conversion exit underscore out external right so to convert from say the material has 18 characters you want it to convert into the external format where the users do not see the leading zeros so you do the uh, external and then when you want to write it in your database you want to do it internal with the leading zeros let's see how it we can do the same thing with using alpha function we'll do the same thing we'll comment our earlier part and then we'll write our own code for alpha function 15 alpha so let's let's do a simple say uh, i since i gave you matner as an example uh, let's try to do for matner only okay so what i'll do i'll declare a material i'll be matner and then i'll give an initial value sorry and i'll give an initial value because i know 18 character matner 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 then i'll give you 10,000 number 10 11 12 13 14 15 16, 17, 18. So I hope there are 18. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So there are 18 characters. Now I want to convert or write them um, so that when user wants to write it in external format, it should print only this number. And when it wants to store in the database, it will print the whole with the leading zero. All right. So earlier used to do conversion exits. Now we can do it with alpha. Let's see how we can do that. So we'll we'll say right we'll just make uh, we'll just keep a history what was the initial one before conversion okay so i will use our favorite uh, pipe delimit uh, pipe to concatenate before conversion uh, what was the value also before conversion it was matna this was the data user had now i'll say i'll convert it so i'll say lv matna equals to um, I'll write what what should I write? LV, I'll write it in a function, right? It's a variable LV matner ALPHA equals to out. That's it. So you will get your output in um, output format. So I'll say write just for clarity. I'm writing it. You don't need, I, I know you must have understood it after alpha. ALPHA conversion conversion out so this is after alpha conversion out what is the value the value will be mm, I'll say I'll be Matner. let's see let's see the output I'll just activate it okay uh, the break pin was there it's gone it's seen that's fine and now let's test it See, see the output so before conversion was with leading zeros after alpha conversion out it is without leading zeros in the same way we can do it for in input also so now the leading zero is gone right now we want to put back the leading zero again so we just make it as in in and then i'll just change the text as well so after input in let me activate this and let's see the output let's see the output so here you go you have the out and the in so without leading zero and with leading zeros all right so so we had to put this here so but we can also skip it so we, we want to combine these two lines into one line we can do that as well so let's see how we can do i'll just comment and uh, comment this part uh, function so on and then here i'll write lv out um, so you, you know that the function you can write anything in the right side in, in inside this uh, what is it concatenation pipes you can say alpha al the same thing al pha equals to out so whatever you had here you can put it directly here so similarly i will just comment this guy um i'll comment this guy and then i'll say alpha is equal to n and let's activate it still so from four lines you are down to two lines 50 percent reduction all right let's test it see you have the same output so same output but the number of lines is less now so you don't have an extra conversion so in the right statement itself you have done i want this material to be converted into outside format and this one to the internal format 
Hope you will be using this alpha function very often in your real ABAP projects.